What's up, everybody? Welcome back. It's just plastic. My name is Hal. You seen the thumbnail? You know what? Underwater Master reviewing today. That's right. I got the Boo G.I. Joe Classified Edward Torpedo Lealoa. That's right. This is my man right here. I'm pretty sure this, uh, I can't remember his background, but uh, I'm pretty sure he's a local Hawaiian. And uh, myself, I was stationed in Hawaii when I was back in the military. So, uh, yeah, really respect that. That's really cool. Uh, I like the art back here. I'm not real sure what we got going on here. Some uh, Legend of Zelda slash Super Mario Brothers. Uh, yeah, I'm not, uh, uh, you know, uh, Attack of the Titans freaking, uh, man, I, I don't even know what this is going on back here. Like, these eels are crazy. Like, <laughs> unless it's like a you know, just to kind of like a comment of the eels that are coming out. You know what I mean? I, very strange. Uh, obviously, there's a reason for it. I just, I don't know what it is. <laughs> there's the side of the box. There's the back of the box. Man, he's got some cool accessories. They really decked uh, Torpedo out. And the, uh, just cannot wait. Number 73. Box looks really good. There's the label or the barcode if you need it. All right. All right. Since he is part of the plastic free packaging from Hasbro, we'll be opening him up on camera just so you know what's inside. So that way, if yours doesn't look like that, you can go, uh oh, spaghetti o's. <laughs> yeah, I know. All right. But first, hit the like and subscribe. Check out all the links down below. Click the bell. Yeah, click it. Just click it. All right, link down below is for the figure. If it's in stock, you will get 10% off at Entertainment Earth, and you will also get free shipping if you spend over $60, or you can use code PLASTIC at checkout. That will help you out, and that will help me out, and I really appreciate that, and that will give me some extra credit the next time I go to purchase from them, and I can get me some other figures, so I can show you guys more stuff, and I can review more items, so appreciate that. All right. Also, merch and everything else. Merch has been updated. Website still in uh, in trouble, but uh, I'm working on it slowly but surely. Uh, appreciate everything you guys have done for me. I'm, I'm keep going. Share my stuff. Like I said, I don't care if you're making fun of me. Share it. <laughs> I don't care. Let's do it. <laughs> All right. Enough of that. Let's go ahead and open him up. Uh, open him up from the top. There he is. I like how they're putting their little art back there behind them. That's pretty cool. All right. Mr. Torpedo. Mr. Lealoa. Torpedo, number 73. Got the star up on there. And uh, there's 73 one more time. Or is that the one more time? I don't even remember what I showed you now. But anyways, yeah, really, really cool. Uh, I, I like the boxes. I was keeping them, but... I don't know if I'm going to keep them anymore. They're getting to be too many now. <laughs> All right, let's go ahead and flip the camera and get into it. All right, so there he is out on the table with his bag of accessories. Let's go ahead and cut that open. Ah, yeah, sharp knife. It just rips it. <laughs> let's see here what we got. Oh, man, he has got so many accessories. Thank you, Hasbro team, for that. That is awesome. Look at all these cool things coming out of here. Oh man, this has this uh, classified line is just getting better and better and better. And if y'all don't agree with me, you're wrong. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> uh, all right, let's go ahead. Look at that. Ah, oh, bragging about it. I got a crooked spear gun. Nothing that's a heat and some adjustment can't fix. Cool. Look at that. Oh, and it even wraps around his arm. That way you don't lose it in the water in case you get hit. Oh, you don't have to hold it the whole time. I like that. That's a good idea. I got you a underwater rifle. <laughs> yeah, I know it's not. I'm just kidding. There's a clip comes out of it. Much better. It's cool. I like how they make them removable. 
all right looks like we got some hose connections we can do here hook some stuff up looks like something connects down here we'll have to figure all that out got him a little shark knife fillet knife however you want to call that got two flippers they are marked left and right I hope you can see that that's neat they're exactly the same just left and right <laughs> and then there's his underwater mask that hooks up so this will hook up in there I made that fairly easy so that'll go like that these do not disconnect that's kind of kind of sucks this I wish this came off a little bit you know what I mean you could I'll make it a little more adaptable, but it's still cool. I like it. And then I'm gonna guess what goes on the bottom of that. Let's see his knife goes in here. I guess either way doesn't really matter. These things are pretty loose right here. They are moving quite a bit, but I'm expecting to see a lot of people that attack these things down over time. Uh, you know, I haven't done anything like that, but I'm, I wouldn't be surprised if somebody does. And, yep, spear gun can hook up right down there at the bottom. I think it's really for this one. Because that one fits really good. This one fits. But this one fits much, much better. Yeah, there's a groove for it right there. So it does go to this one. See the groove? It's probably not for that, but man, it, it works. It fits in there perfectly. Yeah, that's cool. Let's put it on him real quick. What do y'all say? Let's see what it looks like. Well, that's what it looks like. <laughs> Boom! Oh man, he looks legit. I know I was supposed to be going over other stuff, but I'm having fun. Hopefully, y'all are sticking around watching this because I think it's neat. Hopefully, you do too to kind of see it come together. You can kind of just put this around his arm. You know, that one's going to take a little more adjustment, but you get the gist. Got his, got his land gun back there. Got his flippers on. I wonder if there's somewhere you can key his flippers up on here. That'd be neat. Yeah. He looks good, man. I like it. All right, let's go ahead and look at him. Uh, kind of look at some of the more, the de more details to Torpedo. This gun does fall off quite a bit, but. You know, once you get any pose, you should be good. Ready to swim, boy. I got his wetsuit on and everything. Oh, that's somebody we're missing. Just think about that. Sorry about the camera shake. I uh, whacked it by accident. We are missing Mr. Wetsuit. I wonder when he's coming. Yeah. That'd be a good addition to the, to the underwater peeps. You got that line up, so you got to kind of mess with this when you put the backpack on. Really neat. He's really sleek, really slim. You know, just what you'd expect. You know, he's in a wetsuit. He's very, very good, man. I like this. I like it a lot. All right, so let's go down. Let's do articulation down up. 360, no problem. They're doing these boss levels now, so you don't get a lot of down, you don't get a lot of up with the boss levels, but you get the the neck can add a little something to it, but eh, I kind of miss the old way. But it's still good. Shoulders, problem. Does have the little inner swivel there. Bicep swivel, double jointed, pinless elbows. You got typical Hasbro wrist. These are, this one's up and down. This one's up and down. 
This thing's moved again, see? You just whack it barely. Ab crunch, woo, ab crunch is great. Great ab crunch. Uh, got the hip swivel. You get a little more lean and stuff out of that area. That's really nice. Legs. Oh, got the drop down hips. Ugh, I don't like those. Uh, got the upper thigh swivel. Double jointed, pinless knees. That's really awesome. And then you got the, oh, you got a little boot swivel down here. Look at that lower boot swivel. Look at that. And the typical Hasbro ankle rockers. This is, man, this line of figures, this wave is really, really, really nice. Uh, if you haven't seen my other videos, go check out the other videos. I should have a couple of other ones up for this line. Uh, go check them out. If I don't, stick around. Maybe I posted this one first. I don't know. You never know how, what order I'm going to post them in. I don't even know. You know what I mean? <laughs> So make sure you check out my other videos for the other figures out of this line because they are all really, really good. There's very, very minimal issues with every one of them. All right, so that's going to be it for this video. Appreciate you stopping by and watching. Uh, man, I said, I've already said it, but I'm going to say it again. This, this, this wave of G.I. Joe classified figures is probably one of the best, if not the best wave I have seen in a long time and uh hopefully they continue that way because there's a lot of good figures coming up with firefly and so many others i cannot wait uh i got other i'll be continuing this uh wave so stick around i have them all uh and i got scrap iron coming in the next couple of days so that video should be up by the time i post all these videos he, he should be in hand and come uh, uh video should be really soon so stick around uh told you guys i've got tons of videos in reserve that are older figures there's going to be a lot still coming um it's probably stuff you've already seen before but i'm going to post them anyways because uh you know I, I like posting videos and i hope you guys like watching my videos so i appreciate you guys all right you guys take care have a good one and remember it's just plastic <laughs>